Hi guys, my name is Caitlin and welcome back to Kate Straight Up. Today we are making cauliflower rice and we are doing it so it tastes like Chipotle's lime cilantro rice. Why? Because why not cheat with some delicious cauliflower rice at home? Now the obvious and easiest way to turn a head of cauliflower into some nice rice sized pieces is a food processor. But that equipment can be very expensive and not everybody has one or sometimes you just don't feel like taking out your big food processor. So we are going to be making our cauliflower rice with an old fashioned cheese grater. So we are going to start by taking the head and pulling off all of that excess green junk towards the end of the stem and then we're just going to grate it up. Now some other food bloggers or some other people out there might tell you to chop up your cauliflower into some smaller pieces before grating. Now I'm not trying to knock anybody but sometimes people just add steps. There is no easier way to grate this cauliflower than as a whole. When it's whole like this you can hold on to the back end of the stem, get a nice grip on it and really be able to push it into the grater so you get some nice rice sized chunks. So. I mean, could this be easier? As you can see, just like that, we got some nice rice sized pieces here and it didn't take much work at all. So this may take you a minute, but you're just gonna rotate your cauliflower and kind of evenly grate it. May have to switch your grip all the way around. So it may take just a little bit of elbow grease and it may be a little bit messy, but you could get that whole cauliflower down into some delicious cauliflower rice. Now it's time to cook this up and make it Chipotle style. So we melted up about a tablespoon of butter. We're gonna use butter instead of any kind of olive oil. I guess if you wanted to, you could substitute, but we're gonna use butter here. And then we're just gonna dump our cauliflower rice right into our pan. All right, so Chipotle's rice that they put in their burritos and burrito bowls, my favorite burrito bowl, is actually quite simple. It's just rice, a little bit of butter, salt, pepper, cilantro, and lime juice. So we're gonna cook up our cauliflower rice here a little bit in our butter, and then we're gonna add our other ingredients. So we're gonna do a little bit of sea salt, just crack that in, and a little bit of pepper. I actually don't know if Chipotle's has pepper in it, but I put pepper on everything, so we're salt and peppering this bad boy. Then we're gonna add cilantro to taste. Whatever you think is right, I think just kinda give it a nice shake over top and mix it all the way through. All right, now for our lime juice, we're just gonna slice the lime in half and go ahead and squeeze it all into our rice. You don't want too much. You don't want the lime flavoring to be overpowering but you definitely want to have, that's kind of like Chipotle's secret ingredients, the lime in their rice. So you definitely want to taste it, not overpowering. So you're just going to mix this all up, let all your flavors get together, make sure it touches every piece of your rice, and you're going to let it sit on your stove for about 15 minutes until the cauliflower cooks until a rice texture. Now, you need to be stirring every once in a while or else your bottom pieces will burn. So just make sure to keep on stirring it, have it on medium to low heat and cook that cauliflower into rice. And here's your nice steaming hot finished product, some delicious cauliflower rice with cilantro and lime to taste like you are eating Chipotle. And it's freaking cauliflower. You could eat this entire bowl if you wanted to. It's not bad for you. Does it get any better than that? I know you guys all like some other rice recipes out there, so comment below this video and let me know what other rice recipes you would like to see using cauliflower rice. I'm already thinking maybe some Chinese style fried rice? Just throwing it out there. Please subscribe to Kate Straight Up for more fun recipes every Tuesday. Tweet at me at Kate Straight Up, comment, do everything that you need to do guys, and other than that, I'll see you next time. Bye bye!